I was always under the impression I had to put 20% down to buy a home. And a lot of buyers, maybe it's first time buyers, think that that's the case. And it's just not. And so what I wanna do is actually show you just real quick the different options you have when you're looking to purchase a home and potential down payment options so that way you can get into the first home or even the next home without having to come in with this 20% down that everybody thinks is absolutely necessary. It's just not the case. So here we go, quick little, I apologize that the light's showing on the screen here real quick, but I wanted to kind of show you down payment options. Obviously if you're VA, if you're military, it's 0% VA, you can do it, it's amazing. So I would highly take advantage of that. Most of the VA people know about that. Three and a half percent is FHA. That's an FHA loan through the government, right? So that is a great one to do. There's other fees and things on top of that, but consider that three and a half percent down payment on a home you may want to consider that, it's a great option. And if you go 5%, a little bit more, you can get into conventional type loans, as they call them. Conventional loan, not government backed, conventional loan, as little as 5% down on single family homes and even potentially some condos, right? And when you start getting into 10 and 20% down, that's where likely financing condos, not just single family, likely takes place in the 10 and 20% down category. So just so you're aware of that. But I wanted to also give you an example of what it would look like in terms of a payment difference on an average priced home in San Diego County at 10 and 20% down payment, okay? So here we go. Let's presume $750,000 home for a moment. 10 and 20% down payment. So you're looking at 75,000 or 150,000 down payment. Now, a lot of people say, well, gosh, you know, I don't have the 150,000, but I wanna buy a home. I can put down 75 and I can do it that way, great, get into the first home and buy that $750,000 house. Let's look at the payment, because this is what's important if people say, oh gosh, I'm gonna put 10% down, my payment's gonna be higher. You're right, it will be. But let's look at the difference, right, in that payment versus the down payment, because the difference here is $75,000. Whereas the payment difference, if you look at the principal interest taxes and insurance, PITI, on a $750,000 home, Let's presume a, right now in San Diego, let's use a 3% interest rate that we're seeing in the marketplaces right now. Okay, the PITI on a 10% down is gonna be about $4,168 a month. That's principal interest taxes and insurance, San Diego County, okay? Now 20% down, your payment's lower, about 3,500 for the principal interest taxes and insurance. The delta between these two is about $668. $668, dollars Now. What I think is important to understand is, okay, that's $668, yeah, that's a lot of money, but otherwise I would have to come in with 75,000, right, and down payment. So what is that difference divided by? If I take $75,000 delta here and divide it by the $668 per month delta here, what does that look like, right? How many months am I gonna have to go through to make up that difference? It's 112 months. It's 112 months that you're gonna to have to go through before that difference is made up. So think about that for a moment, right? Because what you can do, okay, is you can get into the home, as markets change and things appreciate and things like that, you get to the point where you have 20% equity in the home at that point, and you can refinance the home and take out this mortgage insurance difference in the payment. Very, very, very important so you can understand the, be the, the benefits of that. If you only have this and you're trying to get into that home, you can do that and then in some time, refinance it and get that payment down but because of the equities up. The equities up and you have the 20%, so they pull off the mortgage insurance and then now your payment's dropped but yet you're getting the, the advantages of getting into the home with only 10% down. Does it make sense? So I think that's important. Here's your options on the down payments. 0% for VA, 3.5% FHA, 5% conventional, 10% conventional, and 20% conventional as we all know. So hope that makes sense. Any other questions, get in touch with us. Love to be a resource for you if you're looking to buy, sell, or invest here in San Diego. Until next time, have a great day.